Don't know why I'm drifting, I'm drifting so Out of my mind Hey guys, this is your reading, uh, you versus them, for the 19th or the 26th. This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome. Please like, share, subscribe, comment um, if you like the video. And to my subscribers, thank you guys as always for um, coming out and um, supporting me. The Wheel of Fortune flipped over in here. I feel like there are massive changes going on around you guys. Um, Karma is definitely at play in your situation. I feel like you're looking for something, though. There's something that you're looking for. Um, this is almost like a want. Something that you feel like is going to make you happy. Something that hadn't happened yet, but um, you're looking forward to it, though. Let's see how um, you guys were viewing the relationship with this person in the past. How has Virgo been viewing the relationship with this person in the past? Queen of Swords. Every other day you want to cut their ass off. Mm -hmm. Like you were always having to dig and dig and dig for the truth. Feeling like this person hasn't been honest with you. Hiding things from you. Um, almost like the tower is like standing right in the middle of your relationship just ready to fall to pieces here Gemini Libra Aquarius energy how has this person been viewing the relationship with Virgo how did the this person view the relationship with Virgo in the past Knight of Swords again always arguing um, always feeling like there was tension you guys couldn't get along you really weren't hearing each other maybe you know you guys would get into these um, not very good communication uh, to say the least but I feel like it's almost like a constant battle of wills and and who's right and you know who's gonna be heard that sort of thing <clears throat> What's currently going on with my Virgos? What's currently going on with my Virgos? Ten of Cups. I feel happy right now. There's something that's, um, I feel that is filling a void or either you're optimistic, very optimistic about a situation or either you guys are just determined to be happy regardless of this situation with this person, regardless of what has happened or what's going on. You're determined to get it, okay, with or without this person, I feel. What's currently going on with the other person? Six of Cups. Oh wow. Reminiscing about the past. But you know, it's like this person is, um, they're almost, I don't want to say unstable, because that's not the word I'm really looking for. Um, Sometimes they're caught up in the good times, like really caught up in the good times. And then other times um, they they reminisce and feel like, you know what, what happened between the two of you if you guys are not together is for the best um, because you argued a lot. But um, this person still wants to, it's almost like they feel like if they can prove a point to you, then um, things could be better. When I don't think they realize that that's probably part of the reason why you guys are um, in this situation right now is the whole thing of trying to prove a point to each other and not really listening, you know. Let's see. But they're definitely reminiscing. Um, they think of you guys as family. They think about some of the things that were said. Maybe they were hasty in saying some things to you. <clears throat> Let's see. What's influencing Virgo right now? What's influencing Virgo right now? 
Five of Cups, having regrets. I feel that, you know, there's an apology um, on the table here. Having regrets about this situation because there's something about this person that makes you happy too. You know, you guys feel like family to each other. Maybe you guys do have a family. But the relationship, I feel you're thinking, was not all bad. And so you're, you're having regrets about some things and, and kind of feeling down. Um, maybe you feel like there's been a missed opportunity here with this individual. Scorpio energy, Pisces, um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy is currently here. Let's see. What's influencing the other person? What's influencing them? Ten of Pentacles. You guys have the Ten of Cups and they have the Ten of Pentacles. They want it back. I feel like, you know, you guys mean a lot to each other. Um, they don't want to throw this away. They don't want to throw this away. They feel like you guys belong together. And I feel like y you feel the same way, honestly. I feel like you're mo more emotionally attached to them and they're more um, not really physically attached to you, but they're attached to the stability that you guys provide for them, whether it's financial, whether it's just support in general. But nevertheless, you guys, you, you basically feel the same way about each other. So that's what's influencing um, them right now and reminiscing and thinking about, you know, what they have if you guys still are together or what they had with you. Okay. I'm getting the sense though that you guys are also, some of you are feeling um, regretful because it's like it's time to move on. Some of you are just like, this is not going to work out. It's time to move on. And that's what you're having um, regrets surrounding. What's coming in for Virgo? Okay, something wanted to come out there. It didn't know. What's coming in for Virgo? An ending. There's death. Also Scorpio. You're embracing... Um, Regretfully, uh, this the ending of this connection for some of you. Feeling like, you know, this is it. Feeling like it's, a, it's been a long time coming um, with this energy. I'm hearing from some of you, it's like, it's been over for a while now. What's coming in for the other person? King of Swords. Hmm. This person is going to act like they don't care. But they do. But they do. And you see here, we have the Queen and now we have the King. You guys are definitely a couple in the sense of the suit. Um, you know, very much in your heads, very much trying not to allow the other one to affect you emotionally. Mm -hmm. This could definitely be an air sign for a lot of you. Um, for others of you, this would be, I feel, a Scorpio very strongly. Very strongly. Scorpio, um, Pisces, Virgo. Scorpio is very strong. And um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, energy. Okay. Yeah. This person's not going to fight you. If you're trying to end it. They're not going to buck. They want to. Because they want to save it. Okay. What's the outcome for Virgo? What is the outcome for Virgo? Oh. Outcome for Virgo. 
the emperor, king of kings, standing in your power, putting your foot down, not budging. Aries energy there. Not budging. Looking forward, looking to the future. And not begging anybody, not going towards anybody, because the emperor doesn't go to people. People come to the emperor. Okay. What is the outcome for the other person? Four of Pentacles. Closing off, shutting down. Shutting down. Mm -hmm. They'll still hold on to you. They'll still hold on to you without you even knowing it because they don't want to let it go. They really don't. I feel like this 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 is gonna. If you guys are leaving this person or have left this person, this person is um, in a financial pinch, too. Okay, Capricorn energy there. So that is what I have for you guys, and um, I'll be speaking with you soon. Bye now. Oh, I've been blind too long. Now I finally see the real and fake. Who's down for me? Yeah. The situation wasting my time I had enough, I'm tired of the lies Blah, 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 da-da-da-da-da What are you saying?